I made this really big plan that I'm going to do a circumnavigation of the world in a small aeroplane, but I, I kind of realized that this is just me chasing something else as well. Yeah. And that there, there is actually something more important to me that I truly want to pursue. Yeah, I'm really curious why, like, do you even know why you asked that question? You have okay, no... I like this because this is like, a natural, it's coming from a natural place rather than a limiting place. Like, you are this age, so... You have to, ha yeah. yeah. That's cool. Should be fun. Do you want to be a businesswoman? Indeed. I, yeah. I feel like you could have that very like strict, disciplined CEO nature about you. Really? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I do have something similar to that. Yeah. Very strict. Do you think that's... Is that something about you or something that you got from your parents or is it like... Well, new idea, both probably. Mm. But I've always been like that, so I guess it's not coming from my parents. So maybe I inherited it. But I don't know. Well, weird, but I got used to it. You got used to it just now, or you mean this happened before? I got used to people, I don't know, coming up to me and Asking whether I'm doing good. Asking really? about my day, yeah. It's usual here. Not in my hometown, do Only here. It's like a real life Tinder. Yeah, it is. <laughs> <laughs> Indeed. Okay, I'm going to leave you to enjoy a day. Okay, thank you. Um, Same to you. Have a good one. But in the moments of silence when she was sitting there, and I just seen both of you sitting there in silence, what was her expression like in that moment? Was it just blank? Blank, pretty much blank. Blank but looking off or? Looking at her phone or looking it off. And I was thinking then, shall I continue this or not? Because of what you just told me before. She's not engaging with me at all. Why waste my time on something? So if you're going to invite the woman into it, it's not just I'm inviting you and now I'm going to start to just talk. I'm inviting you. Let's both have something together. So it moves from it's just me to togetherness. So as we're having this conversation now, like I said before, if you want it to be real, then you have to be real in the way that you come across. It's the only way. <clears throat> I mean, give your real response. Respond in a way that feels most natural to you. Because if you don't, you're giving the girl something else. So give me the response that feels most natural to you. What are you going to do today? I don't know. Is there anything that you want to do? Normally people have something like they need to do in the daytime. Do you, are you in a time now where you just don't have anything to do at all? Or you're taking time off to rest? I don't know. I find it strange you don't like, you, you just say I don't know to everything. Yeah, because I don't, I don't, I don't know. <laughs> I feel like you do know, but you don't want to tell me. Uh, no, it's not that. It's just that I don't, I don't know. Do you feel like what I'm giving you is conducive for us to talk? No. It's not, is it? Okay. I want to have a conversation with you, but you keep saying, I don't know. This is the most normal, natural response you would actually have, but you're like, what do I say? Yeah. Anytime expression is involved, it's never, what do I say? 
it's what do I feel right now. Yeah, yeah I feel that this person isn't giving me anything back. From that place of feeling, you can express something. Yeah. And this is the same thing I want you to do when you're walking up to women. If you want to have real connections, you must be real yourself in the way you're coming across. Even if it means the girl doesn't like you, she doesn't want to talk to you anymore, at least both of you now have something that's real. We don't want to be with each other. We don't want to talk to each other. That's also real, just mm. as much as we, are, we do want to be with each other. We do want to talk to each other. Mm. Both are simultaneously equally real. I made this really big plan that I'm going to do a circumnavigation of the world in a small aeroplane, but I, I kind of realized that this is just me chasing something else as well. Yeah. And that there, there is actually something more important to me that I truly want to pursue. Mm -hmm. Which how is, old are you? How old am I? Yes. What, why do you ask this question? I don't know. I'm just curious. Like, I mean, I can say it from your, your face because yeah. I think 28? I'm a bit older. 30. 33. 33? Yeah. What about you? I am uh, 38. Sorry, 28? Yeah. Okay. Uh, sorry. But it, it really um, interests me why people put so much focus on... On the age? Yeah. Like, I, I did, why did, what was your process in like, do you want to answer that? It's just uh, really, okay. because she's waiting. See ya. Okay, that's Okay, Vedek. See ya. So why uh, people focus on Yeah, me? I'm really curious why... Like, do you even know why you asked that question? I know why I am, why mm -hmm. I am, did I? Because uh, about your experience that... You... I thought that you has to be a little bit old mm -hmm. because uh, you are so uh, focused and uh, <laughs> motivated uh, but your age doesn't seem that you are so old so mm -hmm. that's why I was a little bit confused with okay. how old could you be mm -hmm. if you have okay. so... I like this because this is like a natural, it's coming from a natural place rather than a limiting place like you are this age so... You have to, ha yeah, yeah. Yeah, and actually it's never late to be who we want to be, come. Yeah. So, yeah, it is just, I think the system what mm. makes us to do what exactly, we are yeah. uh, doing yoga and medit medit meditation mm -hmm. and so on. This is the same for me. My first spiritual experience was when I went to Bali. Because my ex-colleague, he was into spirituality before. And he had some like masters that he knew in Bali. And he invited me to go with him. Mm -hmm. That's when I first opened my eyes to this. Yeah, actually, people are so different there. Yeah. The atmosphere and um, you know when a people has something which is come from out. Mm. I don't know how to say it in English. It's come from out. Like you don't even have to say anything because yeah. your eyes is big. Speaking. Here because it's so yeah, it's so hot. I'm like, <laughs> it's, I'm getting sorry, suntan. Sorry, sorry. No, no, it's not your fault. Um, <laughs> sorry, I really have to okay. go. Okay, well. You can find me on Instagram. I'd yeah. rather just take your number and then. Do you have WhatsApp? Do you wanna? Do you have a Hungarian number? Yeah. Did, did you grow up here? Sorry. Did you grow up here? Grew up here. Grow up here. Yes. Yeah. Because you don't look typical Hungarian to me. No. Then it was. But that's not a bad thing at all. <laughs> it's fine. And it's just uh, A L E X A? Yes. Everybody thinks that I come from Sweden.